Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to make a frequency distribution with the help of pivot tables. So say the question is make a frequency distribution for the revenue column using pivot tables. So these are the steps. Step one, just click anywhere inside the table go to insert and pivot table now you must have already made a sheet below so click here existing worksheet go to the sheet below and click on the first cell and do OK you will see that all the columns have become fields here and our job is to only focus on the revenue field so now what you do is take the revenue field and bring it down to rows then right click inside the column here and go to group keep things as it is unless the question states what you need to do now just make a note if this was a decimal then for the starting point you go down one and for the ending point you go up by the nearest integer so for example if this was 4399.6 you just make it 43 or 4400 so go to the nearest integer on the top and for this one go to the nearest integer on the bottom and click on OK so you see your revenue has been made into groups now what you do is take revenue and move it to values automatically the second column is called the frequency so double click on the row heading or the column heading and call it frequency and this should be count and do okay the third column you take revenue and move it again to values now right click in the third column go to show values as and percentage of grand total the third column will be called relative frequency and do okay so 58.46 percent means most of your revenues are between 0 to 1000 and so on it is 38 divided by 65 which gives you 58.46 that's the calculation now we need two more columns so take revenue again and move it again below relative frequency for this one you right click go to show values as and go to running total in and do ok and this one will be called cumulative frequency and do okay so this basically adds 38 to 15 and puts it there 53 plus 7 and puts it there and so on the next column take revenue and move it below cumulative frequency for this one, 
just right click go to show values as and this will be percentage running total in and do OK and this thing will be called cumulative relative frequency and do OK so this basically adds the frequency to the next one and puts it there this entire table will be called the frequency distribution for revenue. So if the question is make a frequency distribution for shipping fee, you do the same thing but with the shipping fee field. If you have any questions, just type below and I will answer them. I hope this helped.